combinational circuit. These combinational circuits are going to produce the output produce the output by taking present input present input I mean for example if you are trying to take a simple calculator a basic calculator this calculator for this you are going to give inputs as 5 is one button and 7 as one button and you are going to produce a result as 535 35 right similarly when for the next iteration if you are going to give some number like 6 and 8 6 and 8 again you are trying to perform the multiplication operator you are going to get 48 only right meaning that this output 48 is depend upon the present inputs only that kind of circuits i can call it as combinational circuits okay meaning that it won't think about the past it won't think about the past whereas coming to another kind of circuits are there those are sequential circuits sequence circuit right? they are going to follow sequence meaning that they are going to think about before going to produce the output produce output they are going to compulsory think about present input as well as previous history previous history these two will yield to the present output okay i mean uh, if you try to take one uh, assumption as a kind of a circuit, so I will call it as a component circuit. For this component circuit, I am going to give n inputs right now. For these n inputs, it is going to produce the respective outputs. I can say that m outputs it is going to be produced. Okay. Whereas coming to sequence circuit, it is also going to produce m outputs m outputs and it is going to take n inputs inputs but this output is not only depend upon these inputs but also it is going to depend on the previous history the previous history meaning that i can say the history is going to store in the memory in the, so this is what i can call it as previous uh, history this is the simple circuit which we can define as sequential circuit okay generally if you if you if you take uh, the basic examples what are comes under common circuits means we have uh, various kind of uh, arithmetic circuits are there arithmetic circuits like adder subtractor multiplier those are all will comes under common circuit if you'd like to convert one code to another code another code those also will come under combination circuits okay or uh, something like encoders and decoders it right? will go through all this one by one later part encoders and decoders also comes under combination circuits and the other kind of combination circuits are multiplexers and demultiplexers these are the some of the examples for common circuits if you look into the examples of sequential circuits registers are one kind of examples where it contains central memory flip-flops are another kind of example for sequential circuits counters are there all these are we are going to see okay fine see basically guys which one is faster combination circuit is faster because these are not depend upon any previous input or any previous history whereas coming to sequence circuits these are somewhat slow compared to common circuit because those are depend upon previous history okay and uh, in terms of design point of view also common circuits are very easy to design because it, it doesn't contain any any extra memory elements all those things right because uh, as there is no uh, memory elements existed it is easy for us to design but coming to sequential circuits it is uh, somewhat complex to design okay so this is what the difference between common circuits and sequential circuits